having that freedom and that control in the wide open space. That's what excites people. This was the crazy scene as a guy rides a hoverboard above Times Square. The pigeons were like, who is that? The man behind the mask, Hunter Kowal. Hunter Kowal. Hunter Kowal. His technology trending across the world. Are you the Green Goblin from Spider-Man? Yes or no? Over the years, I've just kind of been developing this passion for flight. When I was nine and 10 years old, I've actually got drawings still made, just sketching out these flying devices where I could sit on it and cruise around. I studied mechanical engineering in college and I got a mathematics minor. And once I graduated, I did about five years in the industrial world. I've always had this passion to start my own business, be an entrepreneur, and then somehow incorporate that into the art of flight. Calling some of these manufacturers, they would say by quote, you cannot break the laws of physics. It's not possible. You hang up the phone. All right. If one support can do it, then we should be good for tip. Over time, I ended up doing pretty much all of it myself. It's a huge struggle to make sure it's done in the right way because this is years of engineering. Just being really optimistic and thinking about the future. The toughest challenge, I think, was understanding the knowledge that I didn't already have. I would spend 12 hours designing a frame, and then I go out to test it, and then I immediately crack it. If a mistake was made in part manufacturing, bam, there'd be fire. While you can do all of the math that you want on paper, what it comes down to is getting those tests done. It finally worked. It's, it's possible. What's next? I want to see how far we can push this thing. Throughout the entire journey, I've definitely had a lot of crazy experiences. This is a project that I've wanted to push forward since the beginning. There were times when I was exhausted, tired, I just wanted to you know, give up, but I always stuck with it till the end. Finally being at a place where I've got it established, I've got the prototypes done, and I'm actually flying, that is a dream come true to me. This is the world's smallest personal aircraft. Engineered for safe and powerful flight. That is sick. Everyone should experience the feeling of flight. That's the dream I'm fighting for and what excites me most about living. My name is Hunter Kowald and the Sky Surfer aircraft is finally here.